The Power of Habit by Charles Duag Why We Do What We Do Throughout Everyday Life and Business This was one of the main books I at any point purchased for myself and likely one of the most canny ones on learned otherwise known as routine conduct and why it's so hard for us to change. Once, we've gotten used to specific eccentricities. It resembles we're modifying our own brain and body with each move that we make or keep away from. Taking and afterward we're totally shocked when our unpredictable robot mind gets acclimated with what we've customized ourselves to do, feel and think. Unexpectedly one of the propensities I needed to build up for myself when purchasing the book was to peruse about an hour consistently and I needed to accomplish that by perusing this book, be that as it may, I procrastinated for a considerable length of time, consistently I returned home from work or even a preparation on top I felt so drained that perusing, was the keep going thing at the forefront of my thoughts, also, I need you to think about this, between 1, purchasing a book, 2, perusing a book and 3, applying the book can lie a significant measure of time, so don't thump yourself for delaying, from time to time, much the same as a battery we have to energize. At the point when I was prepared I read the book from front to back on one end of the week, taking notes, feeling, stunned at a terrifying fireball occurrence, furious at a patholocial speculator's method of losing everything, furthermore, fascinated by the creator's analysis to shield himself from eating treats at work. It was interesting. The most earth-shattering exercise I detracted from the power of habit must be that you can't truly eradicate old examples or state, erase, an unfortunate propensity. That is the reason it's so natural for us to fall once more into our old ways. It's something we're recognizable. What's more, unusually all right with, yet comfort as a rule is the very wellspring of our negative behavior patterns. Eating lousy nourishment and drinking soft drink is simpler and therefore more agreeable than learning as much as conceivable about sustenance and cautiously focusing on what you put in your body, be that as it may. Since you can't eradicate your negative behavior patterns, you need to supplant them with a decent propensity. What many individuals will in general do here is supplant one unfortunate propensity with another negative behavior pattern. At that point, fall once again into old examples and now they're off path more terrible, with two negative behavior patterns. You see this for instance when substantial smokers choose to prevent themselves from manhandling their lungs, which is incredible and it works out in a good way for half a month, perhaps, yet at that point, at whatever point they felt the tingle for a smoke. They ate some treats that was lying near or even reveled in an additional feast for each day and in record time they put on a great deal of weight, feel hopeless, return to smoking again and now they're at another unsurpassed low. Rather, what our prime model could have done is discipline oneself to run a mile, do a couple of hopping jacks or push-ups, at whatever point the person felt that requirement for a cigarette. I had this one talk with a genuinely hefty, substantial smoker unrivaled of mine at the office. I was savvy enough not to discuss fat loss or anything of that nature with her, however she was bothering me. By one way or another the point enslavement came up and she asked me and my associate, in the event that we drank clicker, routinely, on the off chance that we smoked or even had a go at anything illicit and first of all, I'd never advised her, truly, I thoroughly have. And second I had and still have nothing to do with these exercises. Without a doubt, I've had a tequila shot or two like a bunch of times. Yet the moment I began cherishing working out around four years prior I never at any point gave an idea to liquor, which drove me to remove myself from some crab container, counterfeit companions, who disclosed to me I've changed. I'm despite everything annoyed about that. Try not to tune into these failures who put you down for developing yourself, they would prefer not to see you develop, in light of the fact that they're burning through their time, while you're getting far, in front of them and it causes them in their delicate inner self to feel awful, and it should, in any case, my land whale of a chief, she was an undesirable individual, assaulted me, due to my enthusiasm, for working out, my propensity was so solid, I cherished it with my entire existence. I was unable to hold back to get to the exercise center. What's more, when I was done with my exercise I did a couple more finishers and needed to drag myself out of there. Presently here was this lady, 
who drank containers of Coca-Cola consistently going about as like exacting, boss investigator of the overall well-being organization, disclosing to me how unfortunate my dependence on functioning, out was, what, do you even rationale, I would not like to contend and eclipse my lord pointlessly and just concurred, however I included, I'd preferably have my dependence, my running high, as she called it, than some other enslavement, I was glad for myself and how decided I was in the rec center, I wasn't going to let anyone dishearten me, in particular her and I trust, you will do the, same thing and you won't let anyone debilitate you from supplanting your negative behavior patterns with positive, ones that will just duplicate in number, overlook all the clamor, I'm not going to take a fat people weight reduction exhortation, I'm not going to take a needy individual's venture counsel, I think this is genuinely self-evident, be cautious who you tune into, particularly when they're near you, negative behavior patterns are frequently connected with peer weight and gathering think, that is the reason you gotta have an independent perspective and act naturally dependent, as we've talked about commonly, on this channel as of now, I got section 2 on this book coming out tomorrow where we get into the quick and dirty of evolving a propensity to a positive one, make certain to look at that and remember to buy in, so as to build up viewing my down to earth recordings as one of your great propensities, of viewing misleading content, superstar, top 10 something records that require zero ability to make, previously, I began doing that, since it's more beneficial, I'm joking, but at the same time I'm somewhat genuine, on the web, whatever you click on, you make a greater amount of, it would be ideal if you remember that and have an incredible day, converse with you soon.